over the last eight to 10 years, pretty much every coral reef area in the world has experienced severe impacts from marine heat waves leading to coral bleaching. We've seen bigger impacts in the last few years than ever before, including very large amounts of coral dying in shallow waters on reefs throughout the world. At one and a half degrees of warming, with strong local management to boost resilience, we think we can protect coral reefs in many places. But as we approach two degrees, and certainly as we pass it, we will lose the world's coral reefs and all the benefits that they give to humanity. Our current target for the coral seeding intervention that's being developed is to deploy tens to hundreds of millions of corals per year. And so the research that we're doing here is looking at how we can upscale, how we can deploy large numbers of corals, and where we should be deploying those corals to maximize the chance of survival and success of the intervention. The reef is resilient and it can recover from these acute events if we give it a chance. So we need to reduce emissions and give this wonderful, beautiful, iconic system a chance and to let people know that it's worth fighting for.